I really want people to understand this because people think that sanctions are some kind of peaceful alternative to war. My, my cousins told me they would rather live under the bombs again than to have sanctions. That, that's how bad it is. Because in Damascus now it's quite peaceful, but for a long time it wasn't. You had a, a shelling uh, like I was just talking about earlier. And my cousins were telling me they would rather live under that again than to be under the sanctions now. Wh would, why? Like, everyone is, is starving. Uh, actually, Syria was um, uh, self-sufficient and a, a net exporter of wheat. So there are no bread lines. There are bread lines now. Why? Because of Western sanctions. And that, that, it, that must be a scene as a part of the war. We shouldn't think that, oh, the war is just bombs. No, no, no. There is a siege warfare. It's like in the Middle Ages, they would come and they would surround a city and cut off the food and people in the city would die of starvation, malnutrition and disease. And this is what sanctions do. And the suffering in Syria has not stopped.